<laughs> Thanks for joining us for this beginner series prenatal core mama class. These short classes are designed to be used as precursors for beginners to the longer core mama classes. We'll start standing as we are, moving toward the end of the mat, inhaling arms out and up, exhaling hands to the heart, inhale up, exhale hands to the heart. One more deep breath in, stepping your feet wider, and exhaling, hands to the heart, folding in half wherever you land. Feet open wide enough to make space for your belly. Stay here for two deep breaths. If you can release further into the pose, do so. And use an inhale to lift to a straight spine. Exhale, release. Bending the knees, bring the hands up to a place just above the knees and sit back onto your seat, weighting the hands slightly. Inhaling, lift your tailbone up and your chin. Exhale, tuck the tail under. Inhale, lift. Exhale, tuck. Pelvic rocking, inhale, lift. Exhale, tuck. Inhale, lift. Follow your breath. We're activating the abdominal muscles with this tuck and also mobilizing that lumbar spine. Three more. Two more. Working those thigh muscles too. Last one. And exhale, tuck. Taking the knees towards straight, then bending them a lot, placing the hands down to step your feet back. Coming into the hands and knees position, we'll practice pelvic rocking here. Inhale, lifting the tailbone and the chin. Exhale, tuck under. Inhale, lift. Exhale, tuck. Inhale, lift. Exhale, tuck. Four more. Three. Follow your breath. Two more. Helping you build tolerance to this weight base. Your hands. Exhale, tuck. That was the last one. Coming now to a neutral spine or a flat back. We'll practice wagging the tail. Inhaling deeply here. As you exhale, look over your left shoulder, moving the shoulder toward the hip and the hip toward the shoulder. Inhale back to the Exhale to the right. Inhale center. Exhale left. Inhale center. Exhale right. Follow your breath. Three more each side. Exhale left. Inhale center. Right. Inhale center. and right. Last one. Good. Now for a deep thoracic rotation stretch. We'll start with the right hand. Inhaling to lift your right hand up. Exhale, lower it down. Inhale, left. Exhale, lower. Inhale, right. Exhale, lower. Looking up at that left hand, inhale up. Exhale, down. Three more each side. Follow your breath, left. And right. Good, left and right. On this last one, take your right hand under and come down to rest 
on your shoulder and your ear. Breathing deeply here. A total of five deep breaths, so three more. And then slowly pushing up back to hands and knees once more on that left side. Inhale up and thread the needle through, coming down to the left ear. This is a great exercise to work those postural muscles as well as stretching the space between the shoulder blades and behind the shoulder blades. Muscles that often hold lots of tension. Good. Use an inhale to come up. And we'll step the left foot, then the back, then, then the right back into the plank position. Straight line in the body from the shoulders, through the hips, through the knees, out the heels. One more deep breath here. Then drop your knees, lift your feet in this modified plank position. Make sure your hips are in line with your body. So don't have your hips up, have them down in line with your body. Inhale here. Elbows close to your body as you exhale down, shallow or deep for one push up. Inhale back up. Two more. Exhale down, inhale up. Last one down, inhale up. Then open your knees wide and sit back in a child's pose. Building our tolerance for weight bearing in the wrists and hands. Now in child's pose, contract forcefully those pelvic floor muscles to activate a strong Kegel contraction. Then releasing, coming up to hands and knees again, bringing the knees back under the hips. Step your left foot, then your right foot back. We'll repeat that series of plank push-up child's pose. Strong straight line in plank. Then drop your knees, lift your feet. Make sure your hips are in line with your body. So not sticking up or sagging too deep. Inhale deeply here. Exhale down for a push-up. Inhale back up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Once more down. Inhale up and then open your knees. Push back to a child's pose. Good work. Coming down up to sit to finish with a couple of sitting stretches. So you can take your left leg out to the side. Try to sit high on the sit bones, long spine, and gently walk the left hand down the leg wherever it reaches. Then reach up with your right hand and over. This might be as far as you can go. That's just fine. Drawing that right shoulder back to really open the space here on that right side body. Use an inhale to come out slowly. Switch. Taking the right leg out straight. Sit with the tall spine. Come down. Reaching toward the ankle, or if you're able, in front of your leg. And then take the left hand up drawing the left shoulder back, opening that space at the top of the pelvis, reaching up and over. Stay here for two more deep breaths. And come out slowly. Good. Just coming to sit to conclude this short beginner series, prenatal core mama class. Thanks very much for joining us.